Former Shell President Fires Back After Obama Claims Responsibility for Oil Boom Former President of Shell Oil, John Hofmeister, said former President Barack Obama had nothing to do with America's increased oil production and actually frustrated many areas of the energy sector. Obama claimed he was responsible for America's recent oil boom during an event hosted by Rice University's Baker Institute on Tuesday night. Hofmeister challenged his assessment. American energy production, you wouldn't always know it but it went up every year I was President Obama said. That whole, suddenly America's like the biggest oil producer and the biggest gas, that was me, people. The facts are the facts. And, yes, the production did increase throughout his term Hofmeister said on Fox and Friends Thursday. But, frankly, he had nothing to do with it. This was production in states like Texas, Oklahoma, Pennsylvania, Ohio, Colorado, North Dakota in particular. And these were all state decisions made with industry applications for permits. The federal government had no role. Hofmeister said Obama opposed the energy industry at every turn with his actions against offshore drilling and his handling of the Keystone Pipeline. If anything, he was trying to frustrate the efforts by taking federal lands off of the availability list, putting them just, no more drilling, sick. He shut down the Gulf of Mexico for a period of six months he said. Kevin Brady for Congress. Heavy check mark. At Brady for Texas. Obama suggesting he is responsible for our oil and energy boom is absurd. His policies strangled the industry and harmed energy.